Hi guys, little heads up before the video. I was talking with my sister Maud, and she mentioned that there were too many cars in S tier. So she suggested a few adjustments to the tier list to make it more realistic and the S tier less congested. And I agreed. And everyone else was cool with it too. Are no, you so This is a good idea, you believe in Egypt. 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 Well, looks like we're in the home stretch, gals. 19 cars down and 11 to go. We have a lot more to do this video, so let's just jump right into it now. Agreed. Let's do this. Kamada RC410. Just like the original, but so much better. Beautiful handling, beautiful speed, even better design. Easy S tier. Any objections? The silence speaks for itself. Moving on very quickly to the Asoluto Fatalita. Uh, once again, it's not used very much for obvious reasons, but I do have to say that the design is fantastic on this one. The design is super neat, but you can't deny that the Fatalita in general is the most forgettable car in the game. It's just there. Nothing special about this one. It's way too expensive as well. There are just so many more better options to go with. It's probably good in other Ridge Racer games, but this version is not it. Agree with you all. We'll put this one in C tier as well. Hey, Namona, what the f You didn't even let me speak. Not cool. Jeez, calm down, Liza. It was an accident. Mistakes happen. Go ahead, say your piece on the Fatalita. Looking forward to hearing this one. Uh, yeah, it's mid. Well, thanks for wasting our time. Really appreciate that. No problem. Anytime, my good friend. You just bamboozled us there. Speaking of which, look who it is again. None other than the Himmel EO. I gotta be honest, I actually like its design. It just screams glow up. I actually used it for the first time last week. And truth be told, I was really impressed. Vastly exceeded my expectations. They definitely did a much better job with this version. I now see why Sky likes it so much. Um, no? No to what? You. Guys are being too harsh on this car. Ugh, here she goes I again. I for one disagree with you guys. The f*** are you even talking about? We just complimented it, Treasy. The Himmel EO is nothing in again? but a mechanical marvel. Wait the a minute. Pinnacle of engineering, this sounds like something true Skytrail art would in the say. form of a car. That's because it is something aerodynamic said. design. No way, bro. I'm actually spoiler, dead. And a sick drivetrain. Wait, what the f*** is a drivetrain? And there it is. Jeez, did Sky really set you up to do that? Yep, even gave me a whole script to go with it. Guess she didn't plan ahead that well. Does that pony ever learn? I really wish I could talk some sense into her right now, but she just seems to join at random times. Hey, Skyzer, we're putting your precious little shitbox into <laughs> F tier! Sorry, what's that I hear? You wanna die young? Don't even think about it. Well, that definitely got her attention. Are you seriously still gonna be like this, Sky? Nope, not at all. It was all jokes, guys. Plus, I wasn't actually expecting you guys to say good things about the EO. Yeah, it's a really swell car. Definitely deserves A tier. No way! It has to be S tier! Unfortunately, A tier is the fairest option. Sky. Are we seriously doing this again? Himmel, EO, S tier. Yes? Himmel, no, EO. No! No! If you want to live past your 20s, then you will shut the f up, keep the EO in A tier, and never say that again! Understood? Oh, yes. Definitely, A tier is perfect. No complaints here, sir. Blood don't want that marble pie smoke. Who would? The calmest, quietest pony here has melted down more than most of us. Guess the meditation session didn't really pay off? Oh no, the meditation went swimmingly. Heck, if you like marijuana shoved up your ass, what the fuck? Perfect for you. Thank goodness I got away in time. What? Did my ears just listen to? How is that even possible? Oh, it's simple. First, you grab the needle and Wow, then... okay, moving swiftly on from all that. And looks like it's hijack time again, baby. This has to be one of the best designs in the game. For it's real. It's hard to control, but that's a small price to pay for salvation. Damn right. It charges nitrous fast, it is fast, and it looks really cool too. I hated trying to control this thing out of an oversteer, but it's beautiful design made up for it. Make it easier to control, and it's an easy S tier. But for now, I think A tier is fair. You know what? Fair enough. We'll put it in A tier. And that brings us on to the upgraded Evolver, the mascot car. The machine owned by the legendary Reiko Nagasi, and the greatest car of all time. Just look at that design. Epic wide body, beautiful wheels, cool mini spoiler, great paint job, even better paint scheme, sick tires, amazing grill, amazing bumper.
bumper, menacing headlight, cute okay. tail light, all right. and a mad okay. supercharger. Are you done yet? Extremely She's satisfying yet. to control, charges nitrous like a beast, is extremely fast. Oh, it's just perfect. Perfect, I tell ya. Okay, then. Was that really necessary? Oh, so beautiful, I can't even... Was that really necessary? And it's f***ing free, baby! I think it's the cool best car in history. Gosh, can you shut the f*** up for one second and let someone else speak? Oops, getting carried away. Sorry about that. You are right. This car is goaded. I mean, look at those headlights. That's a bombastic Saeed Agi if I've ever seen one. This car handles so well that it almost feels broken. And the design is just so radical. Such a pleasure to look at. I really like this one. It's definitely liked by all Ridge Racer players. An absolute gem in the Ridge Racer world. Second only to the Himmel EO. Oh no, the hell it's not. It's the best of the best. Of course you'd say that after you pretty much sucked its exhaust pipe dry like oh, geez. Damn. Oh, Sky, you're one to talk since you literally blast yourself to the EO on a daily basis. Oh, with how obsessed you are with that car, it's no wonder why it's that color. All right, girls, enough with the graphic stuff. She started Let's it. just put this beast in S tier and move on. And just like that, we've cleared all of the normal cars. Only the six special cars to go and we're home free. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get to ranking these mechanical miracles. Otomaya, baby! Finally, you guys get to see my favorite car in the game. Feast your eyes on the mechanical wonder that is the Namco Pac-Man. Man, I love this thing. It's so unique with the way it uses Pac-Man sound effects for its engine sound. Not to mention its unique physics. It literally f***ing floats. And it drifts so beautifully. Not to mention that it's the second fastest car in the game. How can you not love this thing? Ooh, this one's a sweetie. Those floating objects at the front, the boosters at the back, and Pac-Man in the driver's seat? That has to be peak car designing in any racing game ever. Excellent in every single aspect. Flawless design and performance, and very, very fun to use if I do say so myself. There cannot be a single pony, person, or creature out there who doesn't love this car. I really like how they based its design off the spaceship in the game Galaga 2. Wait, really? I had no idea it was the Galaga spaceship! Now I love it even more! Learn something new every day! What an incredible machine. I've always been intrigued by its demeanor of mysteriousness and its extraterrestrial nature. While it's unfortunate that you can't use it in multiplayer, that didn't hinder my incredible experience with it, and it certainly doesn't stop it from being an S-tier car. Factos, amigos! Glad you all agree with me properly this time. And the next one's pretty interesting. What the hey? Two more joints? Oh, hi, Sugar Bell. Hello there, good friends. I assume that you guys are ranking the Namco Rally X what? now? What's going About on right now? you guys got onto it. This is a car for the ages for Rizzle Drizzle, my bejizzles. What in Equestria does that even mean? Well, Lily, you're here too? Well, of course, Ms. Marble Pie. I couldn't miss out on a golden opportunity like this. Now, if you guys wouldn't mind, allow us to cook. And cook up a stormer. Right now, you are looking at a fine specimen of a car. The king of all special cars. And the boss of all Ridge Racer history. What could possibly be better than a timeless classic arcade car? A timeless classic arcade car in 3D? Correcta Mundo. They took an 8-bit design and turned it into visual poetry. The body, the window, and especially the tires. So satisfying. Oh, and don't even get me started on its performance. Oh, I'll get you started, Powerhouse. Boasting a top speed of 369 nice kilometers an hour. Which is about 400 AK 47s per degrees Fahrenheit for all y'all beautiful Americans. Making it the fastest car in the game. By a landslide, too. This car takes real skill to control. But once you do, you can enjoy all the benefits. Like it's super cool looking nitrous. And it's super long lasting nitrous. And the sweetest engine sound in the game, baby. This sure is enjoyable, I can't lie. Certainly not as enjoyable as using the Rally X. This car will fix all of your problems, even your real life ones. Sounds amazing. Really digging that? I think so it can even fix my unstable excitement control? Of course, Jade. A problem nowhere near too big for the Rally X to solve. Darn even fix my half-penetrated asshole, too? Whatever it is that you need, the Rally X will fulfill the deed. A real fixer up. Wait, what the f*** did you just say, Miss Marble? Long story. Best not to get into it. Well, the Rally X can still definitely solve it with a great concept. And an epic name. The Rally X. Is undoubtedly. The, the greatest, greatest car in the f***ing game. game. Holy crap. That was incredible, you two! My ears and my chakras have truly been blessed. This has to be one of the greatest performances of all time! No kidding! The Rally X was already among my favorite cars. But now I love it even more. You guys really outdid yourselves with this one. It was another long speech about a car.
But it didn't drag. It wasn't annoying. And it was, like, very fun and interactive. Wow, thanks, guys. Your words mean a lot to us. Yeah, we found out that we were both really passionate about this car. So we decided to give it something that does it justice. And the rest is history. Well, since we're all really fond of it, it's no surprise where it's going on the tier list. Yup. Easy S tier, baby. Show me the money. Up next is the Kamada ANGL concept, also known as the Angelus. I never really understood this one. For a car based on the premise of an angel, you'd expect its design to look more regal than this. I agree. The design is a little goofy, but it's still fine for me. I mean, maybe if they stuck like a halo on top of it, then we'd be getting somewhere. Just a suggestion. I like the way it handles, but the front design is a little off-putting for me. I played the PSP version of this game, too. And honestly, the Angelus there looks way better than this one. Same base design, but gives off much stronger vibes that say, a car from the heavens. It's not a bother to control, but it's nothing special nonetheless. Not gonna lie, I kinda have a soft spot for the Angelus. Its flaws aren't a big deal to me since it's the first special car you encounter event-wise. And it's a decent all-rounder compared to the other special cars. I don't know. I just never had any fun with it, but that doesn't mean that it's bad. I think B-tier is good enough for this one. Well, 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 what do we have here? It's the dark and monstrous speed machine known as the Canal. Monstrous. More like monstrosity. Ouch. It's Jade, hideous. are you Absolutely crazy? Absolutely hideous. I never touched this thing in my life, and I don't plan on doing so anytime soon. I'd recommend that you guys do the same with it. Monstrosity? I think that's a bit too far, Jay. Oh, but it's not. In fact, it's not far Screaming enough. Session number Honestly, why do you guys like this thing? It's quite literally the car of Satan himself. And why does it drift like sh skill issue? I don't know about you guys, but this speed demon deserves nothing but F tier. Looks to me like you only hate this car due to its anti-Christian imagery. Its imagery of the Antichrist is enough for me to hate it for life. I mean, if it didn't have it, and they just called it the Soldat Krenal like normal people, then I would have it in A tier, but otherwise- Then A tier it is! is. Oh, LOL, get Shrek, oh, Bozo. Oh, you feckin' langers, the whole lot of ya! Malak Nabontri or who? Moving on from that, let's get on to the Petit 500 mid. Impossible to control. Hate it. A special car with nothing special? Not my favorite design, that's for sure. Greatest car in the whole damn game. I agree with you. It's just not cut out for high- Wait, what? Pardon what me? Did she say? Come on, you gotta stop bamboozling me like that baked dish of metamorphed limestone? I knew we were gonna get to Marble's favorite car, eventually. But I wasn't expecting it to be this thing. Are my ears playing tricks on me? You heard me right. This car suffers massively from judging a book by its cover. I used to hate it too, but eventually I decided to give it a real chance. I spent weeks trying to master this little powerhouse, and I'll tell you, once you master it, you'll never want to drive another car ever again. It's the only car that builds up nitrous super quickly and has it last very long, too. You're pretty much going 400 for the whole entire race. No other car in the game is capable of pulling that off. Oh, I just love this precious boosting little boo bear, baby! It's the absolute best, the very best! Hasta! <laughs> Careful before you have a stroke there. Ain't no way blood emitted bonk juice on her damn keyboard, I'm deceased. Talk about marble cream pie, am I right? Fuck you guys, that was funny. No, it wasn't. Anyways, that's kind of wild, Marble. Never thought any pony would be a fan of that car. Interesting to say the least. Might try to master it myself now to see how it is. Same here. I do like a challenge. I knew about the car's perks already, but it's just not my cup of tea. Of course. Nothing is ever your cup of tea, is it? You could say that. I'm not a fan of tea anyways. Unless it's 420, that is. Okay, that was actually a good one, Jade. Yeah, I'll give you that one. I was gonna put this one in D tier, but after hearing that, I think B tier is a fair choice. You know what? I'm totally fine with that. Great stuff. And last but not least, the Mad Bull. I absolutely love its super fast charging nitrous and just using them in short bursts. Also not a hassle to control. Cool design too. An absolute gem. Hypocrite of the century, every pony. What what are you talking about, Sky? Hate on the Crinal, but love the Mad Bull. What's that got to do with anything? The Crinale is devilish. The Mad Bull isn't. Oh, this is awkward, isn't it? Jade, is there any chance that you, I don't know, went your whole entire life not seeing the triple six on the side of the Mad Bull? Uh, Jade? And there she goes. Can't imagine how stressed out she is right now. I don't blame her. 
She's a very strong and devoted Christian, so finding this out must sting her real hard. It's like being madly in love with some pony for so long and then finding out they're transgender. Odd comparison, but you're not wrong. Welcome back, Jade. You finished coping with the news yet? I think that answers your question. Are you chanting on again? That doesn't sound like Gaelic to me. She's only an exorcism in Latin. Well, what in Equestria do we do? In Paldea. Just stay quiet and do nothing. Extremely high right now. Serpent, serpent, he is the diabolist. Satanas, a creature, me tazen, an abyss. At non se duket amplius gentes. You know what? I never liked this car anyways. It drifts like a bitch. No kippity cap zap. Let's put it in D tier to give the wild gang D a buddy. D for devil! Calm down, Jade. I think the expulsion worked. The Lord God Almighty will always prevail. Amen, sister. And at long last, the Ridge Racer 3D car tier list is finally complete. Man, what a journey it's been. I really enjoyed doing this with you guys. It sure did bring out the best and worst of us. It was exhausting, but enjoyable, albeit. Truly an experience I'll never forget. I've never felt more pure in my life. This was definitely needed. Nothing beats a screaming session with good friends to do it with. I joined in pretty late, but I still felt such a strong connection with you guys. It's like I didn't miss out on anything at all. Ditto for me. I do wish that this gem of a game got the recognition that it deserves. But sometimes some games are better left unpopular. Like a wise pony once said, if, if there, there were no, no hidden, hidden gems, gems then, then there, there would, would be, be no reason, reason to dig. dig. Thanks again for letting me tag along with you guys. I love you all to bits. Catch y'all later. Bye, everyone.